All right, we're back, and in this video, I'm going to do some more website tips for business owners in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. So let's get started. All right, so in this video, we're going to go over WordPress website tips for business owners in Rio de Janeiro, and we're going to focus on creating WordPress pages to help promote specific products that you have for your business and when you publish content with WordPress you can publish your content either with pages or with blog posts and what we're going to zoom in today is this we're going to cover these three elements here the first one is you may configure WordPress to hide specific product pages on your website secondly a simple product landing page helps get the click and begins the sales cycle for whatever your business is also once you build uh, on the third point here it says you can email the specific page URL to qualified leads they can google it you can link to it or you can just tell your prospects the website address that we're gonna do a demo of right now alright so right now I'm going to show you guys a real-life example of one of my offline client businesses you can see the domain name right here health insurance for self-employed in Illinois.com and this is a simple WordPress lead generation page where we can see as we scroll down this is we have our Wufu form right here. As well as on this page, we use a lot of uh, clickable images. So right here, when they click this image, it pulls them right into our lead generation form where the sales department can do a, you know, a do, do a quote for the client. Alright, so the main WordPress website is just a real simple lead generation website in the insurance industry in the United States. But underneath this, there's products that we want to sell. So we're going to create a page within this WordPress site that you will not be able to link to or even see on this page. It will be invisible. And uh, so there will be no links on this WordPress page on this main website to the back-end product however we're going to use WordPress to create a real nice professional landing page to help uh, promote your business so let's uh, let's take a look at that right now okay so if you look at the domain name right here you can see it's the same domain name health insurance for self employed in com forward slash National Association of Consumers Direct. This is a page within WordPress. Here's our root domain name right here. Here's our product specific page. And this page, this is all it is. You, you can't even scroll down. This is just, this is it. And this specific product page will link and begin to an actual sales process where the person can buy the product for whatever niche you're in. <clears throat> if you click this logo right here, we're going to an actual product that the person can buy online and it has a very sophisticated uh, and complex uh, system with, uh, you know, in the insurance industry that I'll spare you the boring details so yeah a person can actually buy the product from this link and shop around and and you know do a lot of different different things and we got to this we got to this point so that person can go ahead and buy you know whatever they want <coughs>
you can see the online application you know this is it this is this sale is about to happen but before we got to this point what we did is we created a WordPress page again we can see the URL down here forward slash on the product and everything on this page even this header graphic if you click on this header graphic bam it goes right to the product that they can buy if we click on this text right here links right to the product so they can buy it so we're using WordPress to really help us as a business owner bridge the gap technically between our product our back-end product and then putting a, a landing page to it so and we can take this domain name or this URL we can email it to a prospect we can tell them about it or we can uh, or the person can Google whatever it is that you're selling and it's very probable that this unique page will show up in the search engine rank rankings and then uh, they can actually buy the product from your WordPress page but I guess really the cool part about it is even though we have this specific page within WordPress where the person can buy the product we do not see this product specific page at our root domain name right here so WordPress does give us endless possibilities with configuring pages and posts that are invisible they're hidden so even on this main website even though we do have endless back-end products to sell like this example here <coughs> the initial website visitor that comes to our WordPress website or business they don't really see the product they're just seeing the the front end so to speak so hopefully you guys learned some tips that you know with WordPress not only can you have your main business website but whatever products you're going to be selling on the back end you can create specific pages within WordPress which will look just like this it'll say you know uh, forward slash and then bam your uh, your product whatever it is you're selling and then we can take this page make it very simple very user friendly and then everything here is clickable to the product where they can buy and then you're now through the sales process alright so that's it for that tip on this video where we took a look we took a look at again configuring WordPress to hide specific product pages simple landing pages to help get the link or the click and then you can take that URL and do you know whatever you want with it for more information check out our website in the description box below this video where we uh, we do all sorts of lead generation and consulting for business owner websites in Rio de Janeiro Brazil